Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Fine, thank you. Excellent. Welcome to the class. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Hello, teacher. Hello. Hello. How are you guys? Are you okay? Very good. Welcome to the class. Let's see. Guys, quiero recordarles. Eh, a veces, si ustedes se conectan desde antes, recuerden que la clase es a las 10, right? Si ustedes se conectan cinco minutos antes de las 10, no, se van a no van a conectarse, es decir, no van a entrar a la clase hasta que yo inicie, right? Una vez que yo me conecto, entonces ustedes sí, ustedes pueden conectarse desde antes de la clase si gustan, pero les va a aparecer un mensajito que todavía la reunión no ha empezado. Ok, así que si ustedes se, con se conectan antes de las 10, I mean, that's good, pero van a tener que esperar hasta que yo inicie. All right, and yo no inicio antes porque antes tengo otra clase, entonces sí, trato de iniciar exactamente a las 10. Así que eh, si hacen eso, recuerden, siempre tienen que esperar hasta que yo me conecte. Ok, ahí no es que falle la conexión, no es que ustedes eh, no les conecte, simplemente es que todavía no es la hora de iniciar. Ahora bien, si después de las 10, ahí sí ya no les conecta, ahí sí ya no es cuestión mía, sino que ahí sí, maybe ya sería la conexión. All right. ¿Preguntas? ¿Es it clear? Yes. Yes. Excellent. Okay, now before starting, let's see the names. Remember first the last names and then the names. So I can see everybody. Very good. Rodrigo Marmol, please. Change your Hello. name. Change your name. Primero escriba los no. last names and then the names. Okay? Okay. Very good. And... Ah, you have the camera on. Thank you, guys. I want to see everybody with the camera on, please. That's not optional. Remember it. What was the topic that we studied yesterday, guys? Do you remember? Uh-huh. Work. Occupations. Occupations. Occupation. Very good. Countries, nationalities. Great. Did you memorize the vocabulary? Yes, so, so. a little bit. So, so. A little bit. <laughs> Today we have an exam, guys. <gasps> really? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it's not for real. But uh, I need you to study the vocabulary, OK? I will give you vocabulary. So what is your homework of every single day? memorize it i know it is not easy because a lot of words but if in the class we see 10 new words try to memorize five at least okay so after the class i expect you review your notes please do it okay at the contrary imagine I will give you the vocabulary, but if you don't memorize it, we are not going to talk, okay? If you want to talk more, you need more vocabulary, okay? Now, yesterday, some people had some issues with microphones, with the audio. Let's see, Natalie, you couldn't use the microphone yesterday, right? Can you do it now? Hello? I cannot listen. Can you listen to her? No sé si soy yo. No. No. Y ahora no. sí está, en, está desde el teléfono, right? You're from the cell phone? I don't know what happens. Um, ¿Está con manos libres? Yes. Intente sin las manos libres. <laughs> a mí, vamos a intentar de todo hasta que le funcione. No worries. No. Yes, I can hear you now. <laughs> Very good. So, Natalie, no sé por qué desde la computadora no la escucho y no sé por qué con las manos libres tampoco la escucho. So, let's try like this. <laughs> okay? 
Okay. okay. Very good. Okay, everybody. Anyone else has any issue with the microphones or something? No? Okay, great. Well, everybody, welcome to the class. Thank you so much for being on time. Are you ready to participate today? Yes, yes, yes. we are ready. Excellent, that's yes. the attitude. Very good, very good. Can everybody see the presentation? Yes, yes. Excellent. Yes. Okay, guys, today is May 18th. This is the class number three. We are in the unit number one. So basically, guys, today we are going to be finishing the unit number one. So tomorrow, if everything goes well, tomorrow we'll be starting the unit number two. Okay, so remember, we have five units, so we need to run a little bit. Now, yesterday we were talking about giving personal information. We practiced a little bit the spellings. So did you practice the spelling? Yes. yes. Excellent. Okay. So now spelling, what do you think? It is easy or difficult? It's something complicated. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, for some of you, you might think, nah, spelling is easy. Some of you can feel that it's a little bit more difficult. So we are going to have a practice, all right? I have here some people, they will spell their names. So you just have to write the names. Is it clear? Yes? Yes. yes. Okay. Notebooks ready, please. Everybody, notebooks ready. You have to take notes, please. And during the audio, nobody turn on microphones, please. So we can avoid interferences. So everybody, microphones off, please. Everybody, microphones off. Okay, pay attention. Here we go. One. Hi, Jack. Hi, uh... Elise, from math class. Oh, of course. How are you, Denise? Actually, it's Elise. E-L-I-S-E. -E. Oh, Elise. Sorry about that. Two. Hey, Sarah. How are you? Oh, hi. I'm sorry. I've forgotten your name. It's Mick. Oh, that's right, Nick. Actually, it's Mick with an M. M-I-C-K. <laughs> Mick, got it. So, Mick, are you going to the gym this weekend? Three. Mike, hello. Oh, hello. Um... Hannah, we met at Ellie's party. Oh, right. How are you doing, Anna? Pretty good. Actually, my name's Hannah, not Anna. H-A-N-N-A-H. -N 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 Four. Excuse me, don't I know you from somewhere? I think so. You look familiar. Do you go to Eastern University? No, I don't. Wait a minute. Don't we wait at the same bus stop every morning? Oh, that's right. But I'm always too tired to talk. My name's Stacy, by the way. Hi, Stacy. I'm Devin. Nice to meet you, Evan. Oh, actually, it's Devin. D E V O N. Five. Excuse me. Aren't you Beth Filio's son? Mike, right? Yes, I am. Actually, it's Ike. No M, just I K E. Oh, Ike. Sorry about that. I'm Liz Jones. I work with your mother. Oh, of course. Good to see you again, Miss Jones. Six. Hi, Tony. How are you? Oh, I'm fine, thank you. I'm sorry, I should know your name. Tandy. I work in the accounting department. Oh, that's right. How have you been, Mandy? Actually, it's Tandy, T-A-N-D-Y. It's an unusual name, I know. 
All right. Could everybody listen to the audio? Yes. yes. Excellent. Okay. Yes. yes. All right. Could you copy all the names? Or do you want to listen to it one more time? <laughs> one more time, please. One more time. <laughs> <laughs> one more time. No worries. Okay, I'm going to play it one more time so you can verify your answers. Microphones off, everybody, please. Everybody, microphones off. Great. Okay, one more time. Here we go. One. Hi, Jack. Hi. Uh... Elise. From math class. Oh, of course. How are you, Denise? Actually, it's Elise. E L I S E. Oh, Elise. Sorry about that. Two. Hey, Sarah. How are you? Oh, hi. I'm sorry. I've forgotten your name. It's Mick. Oh, that's right. Nick. Actually, it's Mick with an M. M-I-C-K. <laughs> Mick, got it. So, Mick, are you going to the gym this weekend? Three. Mike, hello. Oh, hello. Um... Hannah, we met at Ellie's party. Oh, right. How are you doing, Anna? Pretty good. Actually, my name's Hannah, not Anna. H-A-N-N-A-H. -N -N Four. Excuse me, don't I know you from somewhere? I think so. You look familiar. Do you go to Eastern University? No, I don't. Wait a minute. Don't we wait at the same bus stop every morning? Oh, that's right. But I'm always too tired to talk. My name's Stacy, by the way. Hi, Stacy. I'm Devin. Nice to meet you, Evan. Oh, actually, it's Devin. D-E-V-O-N. Five. Excuse me, aren't you Beth Filio's son? Mike, right? Yes, I am. Actually, it's Ike. No M, just I-K-E. Oh, Ike. Sorry about that. I'm Liz Jones. I work with your mother. Oh, of course. Good to see you again, Miss Jones. Six. Hi, Tony. How are you? Oh, I'm fine, thank you. I'm sorry, I should know your name. Tandy. I work in the accounting department. Oh, that's right. How have you been, Mandy? Actually, it's Tandy. T-A-N-D-Y. It's an unusual name, I know. Uh, hi, everyone. How about now? Do you get the answers? Yes. Yes. Yes, teacher. Yes. Yes. Great. Okay. Yes. I, I will be asking individually. So only the person that I ask, only that person can answer. Okay. So let's. See, let me pick someone. Ta -ta 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 -ta. Okay, I can see. Uh, okay, guys, there is someone Esmeralda. iPhone de Esmeralda. ¿Quién tiene ese usuario? Anyone? Uh -uh. Yeah. Oh, okay, thank you. So don't don't forget to change the name, please. Si no en la asistencia no lo voy a poder colocar. The attendance. Yes. Okay, first the last name and then the names. Okay, now, but Stephanie, what is the number two? What will be the answer? Could you listen to the audio? Oh, Esmeralda, I'm sorry, Esmeralda. <laughs> uh huh. iPhone, the Esmeralda, do you have the answer for the number two? Sorry, coach, but uh, acabo de entrar. Ah, okay, no worries. Solo cambia el nombre, please, no worries. Sorry. Okay, let me pick someone else. T -t 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 Tania, Tania Claribel. What is the name in the number two? It's the answer is Mick. M-I-C-K. Okay, everybody, what do you think? Is that correct? 
Yes. Correct. Yes. Yes. correct. Yes. yes. If you wrote it like this, it's totally correct. Very good job. Tania, can you pick one of your classmates, please? Okay. Um... Uh-huh. The ones that you prefer, just give me a name. Um, Helen. Thank you. Hello, Helen. Hello. Okay, Helen, what is the name in the number three? It's Hannah. H-A-A-A-A. -A -A -A. Double N? Yes. Yes. Like this? H. Yes. Okay, do I need an H at the end or without the H? Everybody, what do you think? H. N -H. H. N -H. Yes, exactly. So mm -hmm. if you wrote it like this, it's correct. Very good. Helen, can you pick one of your classmates, please? Uh, Alba. Alba. Okay, Alba, what is the number four? B, E. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I couldn't listen to you very well. Can you repeat? Sorry, teacher. Can you uh, hear me? Yes, go ahead. Okay, B, E. Okay, V as in Victor or D as in David? D as in David. Okay, D. E. Uh-huh. V. V as in Victor or D as in David? The Victor. Okay. O L M. L N. Like this? Yes. Okay, everybody. Is that correct? It's no. Not. No. L no. Ah, no. okay. In this case, the letter L mm -mm, is not necessary. It's just. Devon, if you wrote it like this, is correct. So let's see. Um, pick someone, please. Pick one of your classmates. Give me Hello? a moment. Give okay. me a moment. I sure. Vilma Sandoval. Thank you. Okay, Vilma. Number five. Hello. What is the name? The name is I-K-E. I-K-E. Everybody, is that correct? Yes. 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 Definitely. Very good Thank job. You. Thank pick, you. Pick one of your classmates, please. Madeline. Thank you. Madeline, number six. No, what is her name? No, it's a ultima. No. No, no, I don't understand. All right. Okay, Madeline, mm -hmm. Sorry. Pick, so pick someone to help you. Mm, let me see. Sinaida. Sinaida, help her, please. What is the number six? Oh, teacher, sorry, me too. Me I don't neither. understand the words, yes. Okay, me neither, okay? I got Helen. Helen, do you got the answer? Yes, it's Dendi. Go ahead. E a -N -D -Y. Okay, hold on. It's breaking up. Can you repeat? You say it's E or T? E A T T T T A N D Y. Like this? A. Yeah. Yes, like this? Dandy? Okay, everybody, is that yes. correct? Correct. Yes, it's correct. Yes, it's correct. yes. yes. actually, it's correct. Okay, I know there are unusual names, but remember, that is exactly the purpose to practice the vocabulary and practice the spelling, because we never know what kind of weird names we are going to listen to. So how many correct answers did you get? Five or five? Or four or five, three, four, 
four, okay. Yes, three. four. Four, four three, three, four, three, five. <laughs> four. five, okay. Four. Which one was the most five. difficult? The last four. one. <laughs> Anna, <laughs> Devon. Anna. Okay. Yeah, Tandy is a weird name, right? And, okay. So, guys, let's continue practicing spellings, okay? That's a very important topic that you will need forever and ever, okay? Very good. So, let's continue, but before continuing, I'm going to take screenshots. It's at selfie time, so everybody, camera on, guys. Don't turn it off. Okay, I'm going to take two because we are a lot. One two, three. Okay, another one. One, two, three. Great, thank you. Ah, very smiling. I like that, guys. Very good job. Okay, continue practicing spelling, please. That's not optional. You have to do it. Okay, let's move on. We are going to continue with the topics that we had for today. Just a moment. Let me share with you the presentation again. Can you see the presentation? Yes? Yes. 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 Okay. We studied occupation. So let's see if you remember the vocabulary, but notebooks, close the notebooks. Don't share, don't share, only your memory. So can you remember the number one? Accountant. 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 Yes, accountant. Number two, do you remember? All right, so we have an actor and an actress. Number four? Architect. Architect. And then? Artist. And then? Ensemble. And then? Babysitter. Baby 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 Number eight. Baker. 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 Number nine. Barber. 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 Pretty good job. Number ten. He's done. Yes. yes. That is the one. Eleven. Business. 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 Exactly. So we have businessman and we have businesswoman. Then? Butcher. 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 And the last one? Carpenter. Carpenter. Great job. Very good one. I loved it. Okay. Next one. What is that? Cashier. 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 And then? Chef, cook. Chef, cook. Chef, cook. Chef or cook. Or cook. Then? Baker. Child daycare. Child daycare. Child daycare. Okay. Child daycare worker. So remember, it's not babysitter, it's not a teacher. Okay? Child. The next one? Programmer. Um, a programmer or software. Uh, computer ah. So we can say both programmer or computer software engineer. Then um, construction worker. Uh -huh. Construction worker. Twenty. Janitor. Twenty one. Customer service. Customer service. Customer service. Customer service. So remember, in this case, we can say customer service agent or customer service representative. Okay? Both are correct. Next one. What is that? Data entry cleric. Data entry cleric. 23? Delivery person. Delivery person. Ah, 24? Delivery person. Dog worker. Dog worker. Do you remember the translation? Dog worker. Ah, or? 
Aero. Portuario, right? Portuario. Well, 25. What is the translation? Engineer. Oops. And the last one? Factory. Yeah. Very good job. So remember, suddenly I can ask you this vocabulary randomly. So I always want you to try to memorize it. Now, talking about countries and nationalities, what is the nationality mm. for Britain? British. 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 United States? American. 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 China? Chinese. Chinese. Germany? German. 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 Italy? Italian. 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 Spain? Spain. 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 France, Spanish. French, French. 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 Greece, Greek, 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 Poland, Polish, Polish. 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 Ireland, Irish, 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 Irish. 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 Ireland, Swiss, ah. Russia, Russia, Russia. Russia. Portugal, Portuguese. India? India. India. All right. Very good job. Easy or difficult? The vocabulary, guys. Easy, of course. So remember, in these moments, basically, we are just reviewing some topics that you already study. Okay? Yeah. That's what we are doing. So if you have a question, Please just let me know. Now, we are going to review another vocabulary that is very simple too. It's routine. routines. Do you remember your daily routines? Yeah. Yes? yes. Easy, yes or no? Yes. Yes. Okay, let's see how much you remember the vocabulary about daily routine. I'm going to show you some pictures and you have to tell me what is the activity, okay? We are going to do it in teams, girls versus boys. So let's see which one remembers more. Who wants to start, girls or boys? Girls. Girls, okay, yeah. girls, you will be the first ones and then we will got the boys. Pick a number. Look at the picture and tell me the name of the activity. Okay, but you will have only 20 seconds to answer. Okay? Girls, give me a number. Five. Five, okay. Remember, every girl can answer. Only the girls. Mm -hmm. Dress. 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 He dress. Get dressed. Get dressed. He get dressed. He get ah, dressed. okay. Are you sure? Yes, get dressed. Yes. Get dressed. Can I say dressed? No. 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 I will say dressed. Okay. Get dressed. Very good, girls. Excellent. Okay, boys, it's your turn. Give me a number. Seven. Okay, I heard seven first. Take a, Take a shower. Take a shower. Take a shower. Take a shower. Take a Are shower. you sure? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's see. Ah, what is the difference between take a shower and take a bath? Uh, la bañera. No sé cómo ah, se dice. The tub, right? And remember, take a shower is because we got the, the shower directly. But I'm going to accept the answer because in the end, the meaning is the same. But remember, there is like a quick difference. Also, remember, we can say take a bath or have a bath. Both are correct. Did you take a shower or did you have a bath already, guys? Yes or not no, yet? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And some of you don't say it. Ah, okay. <laughs> Very good. Girls, it's your turn. Give me a number. Number three. Number three, perfect. 
Dry. Driving. 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 Are you sure? Driving. Yes. Yes. Mm. So if you want to be specific, you can say, right? Drive a drive car, a car, drive a bus, drive a taxi. So yeah, drive. Can you drive? Yes. Yes. Yes, yes I can. Uh, no? <laughs> no? Okay. I can. No. All right. Okay. No, I Very good. Okay. Boys, give me a number, please. 15. Which one? Uh, 15. 15. Perfect. <clears throat> uh, walk. Walk. No. Running. 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 Run. Run. Okay. You are giving me boys three different answers. I need only one. What is your final answer? Well, the dog. Time's up, time's up. Only the I'll boys, only the boys, <laughs> girls don't help him. Okay, final answer or no points? What is the answer? Running. 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 Ah. Okay, look at the picture. She has a dog. So when you go running or walk with your dog, the correct one is walk. Okay. The, the dog. dog. So I'm sorry, boys, but this time I cannot give you the points. Okay, do you have a dog, everybody? Yes. 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 No. Yes. No. Yes. yes. Great. Okay, girls, give me a number. Eight. Eight. Okay. Which is the activity? He works. He go to work. Go, go to work. Go to work. Are you sure? Are you sure? Yes. Go to work. Go to work. Hey, hey, very good job. Boys, it's your turn. Give me a number. Boys. Six. Six. Okay. Yes. My goodness. Girls, <laughs> don't help, don't help. Okay, boys, eight seconds. Five, four. Shave, beard. Shave, are you sure? Yeah, shave. Yes, very good. That's correct. Very good job. Okay, girls, it's your turn. Number 10. Okay, number 10. Listen to music. Listen to music. That was easy. That was pretty easy. Very good. Okay, boys, it's your turn. Wow. Oh, okay. 11. One or 11? 11. 11, okay. Go, go to, to school. school. Girls, don't help. <laughs> Only the boys. Go to Which school one? teacher. Go to school, are go you to... sure? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Very good job. All right, my gosh. Girls, go ahead. Number one. Want. Number one. one, okay. Which is the activity? Brush your teeth. Very good. Teeth. Excellent. Boys? Number two. Okay. Take a shower. Take a uh, shower. Take a shower. <laughs> that's the difference. Very good job. Okay, girls, go ahead. Four. Nine. Four. Nine. Okay, four or nine? Four. Four, four. 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 okay. Four. four. Hair, your, oh. uh, brush your brush hair. hair. Brush your hair. Brush your hair. Brush your hair. Are you sure? Yes. 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 Brush your hair. 
<laughs> oh my gosh, girls, you are invicted. Okay, boys, go ahead. Number 14. 14? Yes. Okay. What is the activity here? Uh, eat. Eat. Okay, but a little bit more specific. <laughs> Uh, breakfast. Uh, breakfast. Take a lunch. Take a breakfast. Uh, take a dinner. Okay, breakfast, break lunch, dinner. or dinner. dinner. Breakfast. <laughs> breakfast. Lunch. Breakfast. Yeah. If you see, they are eating eggs, coffee. It's morning. So yeah, breakfast. Very good job. Okay, girls. Nine. 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 Okay. okay. Feeding the, feeding, fish. The feeding the fish. Feeding the fish. Feeding, feeding the, the fish. fish. Okay. Yes. Very good. Mm -hmm. Boys. Sixteen. Which one? Sixteen. Dish. Sixteen. Perfect. Have lunch. Dinner. Have lunch. Have lunch. Have lunch or have, it, have a dinner or have dinner. Have lunch. Have lunch. Have lunch. Have lunch. Very good. Okay, girls, this is the last one for you. Which one do you prefer? Twelve. Okay. Twelve. Get up. Get up. Okay, hold on. Get up or wake up. Get up, Get up. Wake, up. wake up. I need only one answer. What is the final answer? Get up. Get up. Get up. Okay. Get up. Get up. Get up. Yes. Very good. Remember that get up is when you are out of the bed, right? Very good. Boys, this is the last one for you. Make up. Do the bed. Again? Make Do the bed. bed. Do the make bed or make the bed? Make the bed. Make, make the, the bed. bed. Yes, make the bed. Very good. Okay, girls, you're the winners and invicted. Very good job. Okay, so that is daily routine. It's necessary to always, guys, review the vocabulary, okay? Now, continue with the daily routine. We have here, this is the routine about a man. His name is Alan, okay? He says, my name is Alan. I'm from the United States, but now where does he live? In Tokyo. In Tokyo. Tokyo. What is his occupation? Journalist. 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 Exactly. So this is what I want you to do. Here I have different verbs, and I want you to complete the sentences using these verbs. So you just have to decide which one fits better. You cannot use live because we already have live here. So in the sentence number two, for example, I ta, 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 for an English language magazine. So what do you I think? I work. Ah, okay. If you think that is work, you can write work here. Okay, I don't know. So you will have three minutes to complete this conversation, please. Complete it. If you have a question about the vocabulary, just let me know. Go ahead. Complete the sentences because later I will be asking one by one. Huh.
If you have a question, just let me know, please. Read carefully the sentences and choose the best verb. Don't write the answers in the whiteboard, please. You can answer in your notebooks because at the contrary, you will give the information to your classmates. Please. One more minute. One more minute. If you have a question, just let me know. Don't write in the whiteboard, please. Uh -huh. Are you ready guys or not yet? You finished or not yet? Okay, I will give you two more minutes. Two more minutes and then we are going to see the answers. All right, everybody, you ready? Yes? Okay. Yes, yes? all right. Yes. So look at the number one. It says, I'm journalist, I, ta, 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 ta. What will be the correct answer? Get to work. 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 Get to work. Get to work, work or only work? work. Only work. Only work. Only work. Only work. work. Okay, work. if you write work, that's the correct one. Okay, very good. Now, a volunteer for reading number three. I cry. I write. I write. I write. All right. If you wrote this word, yes, that's the correct one. So I write about life in Japan. Number four. Get up. I get, get up. up. Get up. Get up. All right. Get up. I get up early. early. Okay. That's the correct one. I get up early at seven o'clock. And then have breakfast. Have a break. Uh, have a break. Have a break. Breakfast. So have breakfast. breakfast. Well, no me va a caber. <laughs> Breakfast, okay, have breakfast and leave. 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 Home. Home. leave home. Okay, get home or leave home? Leave. 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 Yes. leave. Yes, remember, leave. Leave home at 45 to 8, I'm sorry, 15 to 8, I Go to work by car. Go to work. Go to work. Work. Go to work. Okay. Go to work by car. Number eight. I finished. Finish. Finish. I finished. An hour later. Hmm. And then I number nine. 
I get work. I get home. Get work. Mm, okay. My mom is very far from my office. I, number nine. Get to work. Go to work. Teacher in the number I, I, I think work. is I get to work. Aha, <laughs> we made it. Be careful, be I careful. Okay, what happens in the number seven? Go to war by car. I, I number eight. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's not I finish. What is the correct one here? Get yes, to I work. think it's get, get home. So get I want home. you to tell me what is the difference between go to work and get to work. What is the difference? To work, must get to work. Get to work is start trabajando. Okay, listen. Be careful. Okay, go to work is the process. You are driving, you are on the road, you are going to your job. But get to work is when you arrive. So get to work is a synonym of arrive to work. That's the meaning, okay? So what this says here, yo voy al trabajo en carro y llego al trabajo una hora. Después. Exactly, that is the one. So correct it. Later, it says my mom, my home is very far from my office. I, number nine. Finish. 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 Uh -huh. I finish work at five o'clock and I get up. Go to home. I get up. Okay. I, okay. I go get to up. home or get home? Get home. Get, get home. home. And what is the meaning of get home? Get out of, get get out out of of arrive, right? Arrive. It's not return, it's arrive. Okay? Very good. I need a volunteer. Tell me a name, please. Esther. Esther. Okay, Esther, can you read the paragraph, please? Okay. My name is Alan. I'm from the United States. But I live in Tokyo. I am a journalist. I work from the English language magazine and I write about what in Japan. I get up early at seven o'clock, have breakfast, and leave home at seven forty-five. Uh, 45. I go to the work by car. I get to work and hour later. In hour later, An my hour? home is very far from my office. I continue. I finish. Okay, I finish and um, I finish work at five o'clock and get my home. Very day at six o'clock. I go to the bed later at 11 o'clock. Thank you. All right, very good job. What is the pronunciation of this word? Hours. 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 Okay. Hours. Hours. Very good. Excellent job, guys. So now we are going to talk about daily routine. I want to know all the things that you do. But because you are not beginners anymore, you are pre-intermediate, I want you to talk one minute per question, okay? So if I ask you, for example, describe your morning routine, I want you to tell me what you do, but only in the morning in the morning 
The idea is that you give me as much details as possible. So you can say, okay, well, I wake up at 5 a.m. Later, I take a shower. After taking a shower, I usually have my breakfast. I drink coffee. Um, at 8 o'clock, I ta, ta 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 I don't know, tell me everything you do. So the idea is that you talk as much as possible. Then it says, what do you do in the afternoon? So only in the afternoons. So give me all the details that you can. If you say just, for example, ah, in the afternoon, I watch TV. Is that enough? No. Nope. Can I? No, I need details. So the idea is I want you to try to speak at least for one minute in each question is it clear yes, yes. is that clear or, is it yes. easy or difficult what do you think is it very easy. easy yes remember we are just talking about ourselves okay so one minute pretty easy i'm going to send the questions on whatsapp's group all right so you can read the questions. We are going to practice first with our classmates and then I will interview you, okay? We are going to be in teams of three. So everybody do your best. If your classmate doesn't give a lot of details, tell them, hey, speak more, okay? Very good. Let's go to practice, everyone. And eh, la persona que tiene el iPhone de Esmeralda, Please, necesito que cambie su nombre. De lo contrario, en la attendance no le va a salir que estuvo en clase, ¿ok? Pretty good. Ok, guys, let's go to work. Hello. Hello, bro. Hey. Hello, bro. What's up? Um, Emerson, describe, describe your morning routine. Okay. Uh, my morning routine, the first, uh, I get up at 6 a.m. Then, I take my breakfast, I drink coffee, uh, I watch TV, then I have uh, I take a shower, um, about 9 or 10 a.m. This is my morning routine. What about you, Jose? Um, I wake up 7 a.m., take a shower, and make my breakfast, but, uh, wash the dishes, and Maybe I watch some TV or I don't know. I sleep. What about you? Okay. Okay, I I wake up at I wake up at six o'clock because I'm, I have I have to study at the university about team virtual form. I don't know how to say that. Uh, um, I make the bed, I take a shower for this class because it's the unique class. <laughs> um, I don't know, I, I have a breakfast, I do the dishes, I 
I don't know how to say it. do do the limpieza is a teacher. I I mean I, you have you have different options. You can say yeah. I do housework like tareas del hogar, right? Okay. Or you can say I clean or I do my chores. Chores. Or daily chores, like los quehaceres cotidianos. So you decide daily which. Chores. Mm -hmm. Okay. I do I do the daily chores and, and I'm here in this class <laughs> starting with you. Okay. And just that. What do you do in your free time, Emerson? In my free time, uh, I play video game with my brother uh, every day. And I read a book. Half, yeah. And the finish for my morning routine is um, I take my, my lunch. It's, it's that. Okay. <clears throat> the other. Okay, in the morning, I get up at 6 a.m. and I brush my teeth. Then I prepare the breakfast and I have breakfast with my baby. Then I wash the dishes and I take a shower with my baby too. After that I I have a class each for ten to eleven thirty. Then I prepare the lunch and I have lunch. Only that. And you? Okay. Um, in my case, um, I wake up early, in a specific 6 a.m. And then I brush my teeth. And after that, I clean in my house. Then I take a shower. And besides that, I prepare my breakfast. And then brush the wash the dishes. And at 10 a.m. I receive my class English. Finally, my class I prepare for lunch. And Darcy. Okay. Falta uno, creo. I think. Oh, yeah. Uh, make a dinner and I, I have dinner with my children. And then I prepare uniform for tomorrow. And uh, I, oh, sorry, give me a moment. Okay. And then I run uh, the uniform uh, of my children and prepare backpack and go to the bed. Okay. Okay. Uh, what do you do usually do on weekends, Jenny? Okay, and the weekend, uh, I visited by social media. And uh, later, I I take a a cup of coffee because I need. A cup of coffee in the Diction, afternoon. The coffee. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
and later I I finish my work. My work. Uh, my work is about social media, and, and I need to. Oh, it's I, very very genial. <laughs> and I need to put the finish on my work, and later I I close close my close my my computer and I take a moment for for me and I I how do you say saco a pasear mi perro I I go to go back I have go back me. your pet uh -huh. or walk uh -huh. I walk my dog. I I yes. I walk I walk my dog in, walk. In, the, in the afternoons and later I take I take a I take a shower because it's well and, and that and that moment is is important because is your moment relax. Yes. <laughs> and yes. that's it. What about you? In my case, in uh, the afternoon, uh, always uh, uh, at 1 I, um, p.m., I get my lunch, and after that, I prepare my my uh, homework, uh, English homework. I study uh, for two hours uh, my class and practice. I record the audios. I read uh, someone paragraph. Uh, so and after that, I, I, I prepared uh, my agents for the next day, or uh, I sometimes have uh, awards because I am a freelance. I am the, uh, a community manager, and so uh, I always in the uh, five or six I go to to buy a, a bread, and then I prepare my dinners, and also I I take a bath. Um, also, uh, uh, go to the beta. Fine. And Daniela, what do you um, do in your free time? Um, usually, in my free times, I spend um, my time um, sharing with my friends. Sometimes I go to play basketball with my bestie and go to the cinema and I try to visit my parents because they live in other country. Sunday morning. My Sunday morning is been sometime in the house. We woke up later like at 10 p.m. o'clock because my husband is here my son doesn't go to school so the, so we woke up later with to the breakfast like uh, 11 a.m and we watch movies to amazon prime and if you it's boring in the house we go to the mall to buy the food if you for all the week and then uh, always all the Sundays in the night I going to iron uh, planchar I, I iron I don't I don't know how to say planchar in English yes it's correct I yes. iron I iron all the clothes that my husband and son for the all the week <laughs> Thank you for the answer. <laughs> okay. And you? You, Javier? Yeah. Okay. 
to be honest, um, in Sunday morning, I try to sleep all morning. But if I have opportunity to watch TV, I like uh, I like watch uh, soccer, play, uh, soccer time. For example, I like to watch the match Barcelona Football Club. I try to play in video games, but I prefer to sleep all the morning. It is this is my my case. Mm -hmm. is... Okay. The last question is would be what do you do in your free time, Javier? <laughs> free time. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's very complicated because in my case I work all day, but uh, when I have opportunity to practice soccer, I like playing soccer with my friends. And also, I try to read a, a good book. For example, in this moment, I read book. Um, a... Cool, in this moment. Okay, guys. Oh, okay. Bye. Bye. Pleasure. Nice to meet you. Me too. Okay, time's up. Let's go back to the main room. We are going to wait for everybody. Okay. How was the practice? Easy or difficult? So so. It's a little very, very interesting. Ah, uh -huh, okay. <laughs> I was listening to very interesting answers. I like really? that. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> So did your classmate give a lot of details? Yes. Ah, very good. That's the attitude. Mm -hmm. Okay, everybody, let's go back. Let's go back to the main room. Okay, okay. Welcome back. Okay, everybody. Did you answer all the questions? Yes. Yes. Okay. Did and you more. talk? Did you talk for one minute? Yes. 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 Excellent. Very good. Very good. Did you listen to any words in Spanish? No. No. I used it. No, no. I use it. No. I like okay. a bit. Okay, okay, but let's try to reduce them. I mean, the objective here is zero Spanish, all right? Now, before I continue, I just want to share some details that I listened when I was listening to some groups. For example, some people say, I eat a bread or I buy a bread. Can I say a bread? Yes or no? What do you think? Some bread. Ah, very good. Remember, Some. the word bread is countable or uncountable? Uncountable. Countable. Countable. Can I say a bread, two breads, three breads? Yes or no? Countable. <laughs> yes. yes. Okay. Listen, in Spanish, right, we do. In Spanish, we say un pan, dos panes, tres panes, diez panes. But in English, bread is uncountable. ¿Alguna vez han visto la palabra bread? Bread. Yes. No. No, no. no right. Why? Because la palabra bread is uncountable. Remember que los uncountable siempre van en singular. So no podemos decir a bread. Vamos a decir some bread. Some bread. <laughs> yes. Now, what is the pronunciation of this word? Sometimes. Ah, look. I have a letter S. So sometimes some people say just sometimes, sometimes, no, sometimes. Okay. I like play. Can I say that? We need to separate it. 
you have two options. You can say, I like to play or I like playing. Yes, very good. So those are the ways, guys. Be careful with those little details. If you see little details, but in this point, it's necessary to try to avoid them. Now I'm going to interview you. And the idea is that you talk for one minute. Okay, so I'm going to pick some people. Uh, give me a second. Okay, we are going to choose randomly, okay? And the winner, can you see the screen, what I'm sharing? Yes? Yes, teacher. Okay, yes. the first person is... Marcela, hello Marcela, are you there? Marcela Esther, hello? No, no está? Hello, coach. Oh, Teacher. Okay. <laughs> okay I please. use other other name in because I am in the computer. Ah, oh, okay, Marcel. Yes. No worries. Uh, so yeah. let's see. Describe your morning routine in one minute. Go ahead. I uh, in the morning I usually get up at six a.m. I after that go to the dress. I go to the 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 bed, <laughs> take a shower, and also I get to dress. And after that, I prepare my my breakfast. And after that, take my coffee. And and then I listen to the the audios and check my 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 emails and. Uh, after that, I uh, go to my my class, English class, in specific for two hours. So I I put attention in my class. I repeat uh, uh, the different topics, and so I practice English Time with up. my classmates. Time's so up. Very good job. <laughs> How many sentences did she say? What do you think? I may be 12 or more. <laughs> A lot. Very good job. Very good job. Okay. Next Thank person. You. Next person will be Zenaida. Hello, Zenaida. Oh. Hello, are you ready to talk for one minute? Is, me, is the same question? No. Question number two. What do you do in the afternoons? Okay. Go. Okay. Let's start. Go ahead. Yes. In the afternoon, I prepare my lunch. Sometimes I do my homework, I take a shower again, and sometimes I sleep all the time. I listen to music sometimes. Last, I watch, I watch the series, and I meet with my friends, and I check my phone. I go to the bed at some time. Um, I don't know because all the time I think is go to the bed and sleep or do my homework. Only that I think that happens. And I think that I, I go to, to the mall with my friends. I, I visit my friends. I go to the church sometimes again. Um, Time's up. Uh, yes. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> Excellent. Easy or difficult? Difficult Easy. because I don't have much activities. <laughs> <laughs> so in this case, guys, and that can happen. Imagine if you don't do many activities. Imagine if you study and it's like study from 
1 to 5 p.m., you don't have a lot of options. So what you need to do is to invent, okay? It doesn't matter. I just want to see your fluency, your ideas, and the way that you speak, okay? Okay, we have time for one more person, and the winner is Esmeralda Beatriz. Are you there? Yes. Okay, are you ready? Yes. The question is, what do you usually do on weekends? Um, I usually, I visit my, my family, and especially my sister, and she live in Soyapango. And in the morning and Saturday, I go to go to shore and uh, um, clean my house in the morning, and I prepare the breakfast or lunch for my for my husband, and um, and I, sometimes I rest in the afternoon at uh, mm, 2 p.m. and I sleep. Time's up, okay, very good job. So you see guys, you can talk for more than one minute even. Okay, one more person, one more person and we change the subject. Denise Antonio, are you there? Is Denise there? Hello? No? Okay, someone else. <laughs> Helen, are you there? Yes, hello, I am there. Are you ready to talk for one minute? Yes. <laughs> Excellent. Tell me, what do you usually do in your free time? Uh, in my free time, I watch comics. I like it so much. <laughs> I like to watch video of my favorite singers and Instagram and Facebook and all the applications. I like it. Uh, then I, I watch uh, uh, videos in YouTube. I like it so much. I listen to music. Uh, obviously, so the my favorite singers, I like them. <laughs> um, then I sleep. I like sleep. Uh, approximately um four 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 p.m. I eat um uh, bread with coffee with my mom and talk with her. Time's up. All right. Very good. So you see, guys, you are talking for more than one minute. That's great. Now, before continue, a uh, selfie time. So everybody, you know what to do? Selfie time. One, two, three. Okay. Now, listen, uh, it's very important, guys, as I mentioned, you need to be in the class the full class, okay? Because remember, if you connect from 10 to 11, you miss some minutes. And I have some people here that they started in the class, but they are not here anymore. So they didn't appear in the second selfie, right? So be careful with the attendance. Now, be careful with some details. I was listening to your classmate while they were talking for one minute. I will show you some sentences and tell me if they are correct or not. So, six, uh, for example, I wake up. Can you see what I'm sharing? Yes? Yes. Okay. Yes. Can I say I wake up at 6 a.m.? Can I say that? If I am. <laughs> Ah, there is a difference. Okay, 
Hay una diferencia. What is the pronunciation of this? A-M. A-M. So, si ustedes me dicen I am, ¿qué me están diciendo? A las seis, yo soy. Yo soy. <laughs> ah, so it's not possible. So be careful. At six, A-M. Okay, be careful with that. Again, everybody, what is the pronunciation of this word? Sometimes. 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 Listen, exaggerate the ending sounds. Prefiero que lo exageren a que no se escuche. So, sometimes. Okay? Sometimes. Please, exaggerate it. Okay. Can I say, I'm meeting my friends, for example? I'm meeting I'm my meet. friends. I'm mm. meeting my friends. Can I say that? I meet my friends. Meet my ah, friends. in this case, pay attention, everybody. This is simple present. In simple present, I don't need the ing. I, okay? Unless if you have the verb to be, like I am meeting. Okay, in that case, yes, we can do it. But in simple present, no. Okay, so it's I meet my friends. Uh, she leave. Can I say that? Uh, she lives. person, their person, be careful. What is the pronunciation of this word? Church. 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 So church. sometimes we say like church. No, it is not church. It's like church. say the word chucho. A ver, church. let's see it. Chucho. Church. church. ¿Cómo decimos chucho en español? ¿Decimos chucho o decimos chucho? Chucho. All right. Chucho. So, that is the pronunciation that I need here. Church. 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 Ah, much better. Very good. So, acuérdense de esa palabra, please. Because what is the pronunciation of this? Sí. Sí. This is sí. different, ok? El sonido de la ch y de la sh is different. Esta es más suave, esta es como sh. Chucho. Pero esta no, esta suena como el chucho, ok? Ch, ch. Right? So, be careful. Ok, eh, another one. In Facebook, can I say that? Prepositions. Every time, guys, that we are talking about platforms like Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, or any other, we always say on. Okay? I like sleep. I like to sleep. I like to sleep. That's the one. We have to say Two, okay. And what is the pronunciation of this one? Sleep, 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 sleep. sleep. What is the what is the correct one? Sleep, sleep. or a sleep? Sleep. Ah, I don't have sleep. a letter E. It's only the letter S. So please don't say a sleep. We have to say sleep. sleep. Okay. Understood? Yes. Yeah. Yes. yes I get Very it. good. Little okay. details, okay? You are doing great because you are talking a lot, but we need to continue practicing. So my recommendation, guys, as a personal homework, in your free time, record yourself trying to speak for one minute. Understood? Okay. Great. Yes. Okay. We don't have a, like, well, we only have like four minutes. So this is another topic that we need to study, but we are going to continue it later. Double H questions. Do you remember this topic? Yes. 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 Can you give me examples bit. of the double H words? What? Easy, easy, uh, right? Uh, so if I want to ask about the time, what is the double H word that I need to use? What time? What time? What time? If I want to ask about years 
or date, which one can I use? When. 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 If I want to Who? ask about places. Where. 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 About Where. people. Who? 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 If I want Who? to know about reasons. Why? 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 All right. Why? If you don't remember the double H words, we need to review it a little bit. So we are in simple present. Okay. In these moments, we are checking different verbs, not only the verb to be. So remember the structure, everyone. If I want to create an information question, what is the first things that I need according to the structure? ¿Qué necesito primero? Can you see the presentation? Yes, no? Yes. yes. Okay, so what do I need first? Okay, uh, why? W -H -H -word. The double H word. Okay, the first sentence is affirmative. I study English or you study English. Affirmative. In the question, first, I need the double H word. What do I need next? The auxiliary. 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 the auxiliary. The auxiliary. And after the auxiliary? Subject. Um, pronoun. The pronoun. subject or the subject. pronouns, depending on the person that you are talking about. And then? Verb. Complement. complement. The complement. I need the verb and the complement. What happens with the verb? Is in simple present, in past. Base form. In the base form. Base form. Exactly. For example, where do you study English? Can you give me another example of double H questions, please? Where do you live? Where do you live? Perfect. Where do you work? Where, look, do you Work. work. Can Why you keep... do you love me? <laughs> ah, okay. Yeah. Why do you love me? Yeah. Can you give when me an example? You? Okay, hold when on, hold you? on. Okay, look at this example. He says, when is your birthday? Oops. Now, what is the difference between when is your birthday and the previous one? Ah, in this one, I just have the verb to be. If I have the verb to be, do I need the auxiliary? No, no, no. not really. Okay, now can you give me examples of third person? Who is she? Mm, but using the auxiliary, double H questions with auxiliary, third person. Who does she? Who do you need? Okay, I heard like three questions at the same time. Where okay, who do live? you need? Where does, look at this example, where does where she, she live? live? I'm talking about she, so look at the auxiliary. Does. does. Can I say where does she lives? Because it's third person. No, 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 it's not no. necessary. No. Why? Why it is not because, necessary? Because auxiliary. Beautiful, very good. Remember, if you have the auxiliary, the verb doesn't need any more changes. Okay? Clear? Okay. Yes. Now, tomorrow yeah. we will continue studying this topic because we don't have more time. So if you don't remember the double H word, I recommend you guys that go to your previous notebooks or go to internet to try verify them. Now, today I were giving you the homework, but I'm not going to do it today. I will assign you the homework tomorrow so you can have like part of the weekend to do it. Okay, so please don't forget to attend to the class. Guys, attendance is important. Connect all the minutes. All right, so you cannot lose the opportunity to continue in the program. Do you have any questions, everybody, before leaving? Yo, no. Este, eh, okay, Wendy. Ya podemos eh, trabajar en la plataforma. ¿Ya les dieron el acceso? 
Yes. Uh, yes. 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 Perfect. Perfect. Ok, excelente. Bueno, well, si ya eh, tienen el acceso, absolutely, ya pueden empezar a trabajar y no hay límites. Ok, si ustedes se pueden el ejercicio de la unidad 2, I mean, háganlo. There's no problem at all. Ok, avancen okay. lo más que puedan. Yes? Ok. Excelente. Yes. Ok, you. guys, thank you so much for being in the class. Any other questions before leaving? Yes. No. Yes. Go ahead. No me quedó muy claro lo de la tarea de la homework. Oh, todavía no se las he dado. Se las voy a dar oh. mañana. Oh, okay. Yes, Sorry. no worries. Remember, mm -hmm. esa homework es evaluada, pero los detalles se los doy mañana. ¿Ok? Ok. okay. okay. Pretty good. Ok, everyone. Thank, Thank you. Thank you all for today. See you tomorrow. See you Bye. Tomorrow. Bye. 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 Bye